Administering a UPAR protocol is simple and easy. Today we're going to go through some steps that will help you conduct a smooth and distraction-free UPAR protocol. First things first, let's talk about scheduling a protocol. Make sure that the environment is conducive to learning and that there are no distractions that may interfere with the protocol. Next up, it's time to prepare your devices. UPAR can be administered anywhere on many different types of district devices that can access startpar.com. Ensure that each student has access to a device and provide headphones for each student to block out distractions. This will ensure that the students can concentrate and give their best performance. To help students understand the purpose and format of the protocol, be sure to show them the intro to UPAR video before beginning. This will help them feel more comfortable with the protocol and understand what is expected of them. If you're looking for even more guidance and consistency across students, consider using the optional educator script during the protocol. The script will provide additional guidance on how to conduct a protocol and ensure that all students are receiving the same instructions. By following these four simple steps, you'll be well on your way to administering UPAR successfully and helping your students reach their full potential. So schedule some time, prepare your devices, show the intro to UPAR video, and optionally use the educator script for even more guidance. Happy UPARing! For more information on UPAR, visit texthelp.com.